my channel. I hope you're having a good day. If you're new here, welcome and I hope you stick around and subscribe. Today I have a very special guest on my channel. This is my son and tell him your name. My name is Hayden and I am nine years old. He's nine years old. He is the best little boy I could ever imagine. And today Hayden is going to pick out all my makeup for me. So how it's gonna work is Hayden is going to fill up this basket right here of all the makeup he thinks I should use today. And then I'm gonna come back in do my makeup. And when I'm finished, I'm gonna bring him back in and see what he thinks and how I look. So Hayden is the very first one who thought I should start a YouTube channel. So why did you think I should start a YouTube channel? Because I thought you'd be good at it. Thought I'd be good at it? You're sweet. Thanks. <laughs> so this is the reason right here I started a YouTube channel. He pushes me every day to keep going. Even when I think it's hard, he's like, Mom, just keep doing it. So I am going to leave the room. I'm going to go grab some sweet tea and calm my dog down who is freaking out outside the door. And Hayden is going to pick up my makeup while I'm gone. And then when he is done, he's going to come get me so I can start it on the look. So I will be right back. Okay, so first I'm going to use the um, the Brow Wiz right here and put it in the basket. So just stick around and subscribe. And I am also going to use um, I'm also going to use the um, this right here it is called the Tartiste right here okay and put it in the basket so I'm going to use now Too Faced Sweet Peach this is the cover don't know if you guys can see it but here and then this is what it looks like in the front in the um inside so i'll put that into the basket and now here is some here's this instant age rewind right here so Here's a illuminating primer. My mom really likes this, so I'm just gonna do it, put it in. Cause I hope, cause I love my mom, so I'm just gonna do this one. And here is some blushing bride tart. Here it is, and, then, and this was really, really cheap, so you guys can get it in stores. And this is um by Face Studio Studio and um this is Molten Rose Gold or Rose Fondue. So that is what it is called. It's called a metallic highlighter. So here is a butter bronzer. So I'll put that in. Here is some light illusion. This one is a really really nice on your skin so I, I should get that here is some cover girl advanced radiance here it is oh no here there you go there and then this is i don't know how much this is but i think it was pretty cheap here is some Butter gloss. This was looks really nice. So if you guys want it, you guys can just get it. So I'm gonna go get my mom. Tell her um, that sh if she wants to come in here. So well, see you guys. I'm gonna go get my mom. All right, guys. I'm back. I went in for tea and I came back with coffee. I need it this afternoon. Um, I'm looking through my basket here. It looks like my little man did pretty good. So I am going to go ahead and pull my hair back, get my bangs out of my face and get started. 
So ever since I started this channel, Hayden has been asking to be on it. He said, you know, Mom, most YouTubers put their kids on their channel. And, you know, most makeup people don't. But you know what? I, you know, he pushes me so hard and he reminds me that I should just keep going. Sometimes it's hard. Um, you feel like maybe you're doing something for nothing and sometimes it feels like that. But he reminds me that it takes time and I need to calm down and just keep going. So... He deserved to be on the channel today and I hope that you guys enjoy that and if you would like to see more than just beauty if you would like to see my life as a mom and my life with my kids and my spouse then uh, leave me a comment let me know because you know I'm, I'm interested in beauty and I love beauty but I also love three more people and two more little fur babies in my life so um, I am gonna go ahead and jump in here and see what he uh, pulled out for me so he got me a primer eyeshadow foundation and highlight and he even picked my favorite bronzer bless his little heart foundation and powder all right let's see what he did let's see if I can not knock my coffee over here That'd be great okay so he chose for me the Palladio I'm glowing illuminating primer now I got this um, my sweet friend Jamie has a beauty supply shop here in town in Evansville Indiana and she asked me you know a few months ago if I'd ever heard of Palladio Beauty well I had heard of it but I just never really tried it and I wasn't aware that she carried it in her shop so she was like hey come on in and let's why don't you try a few things out and see if you like it and this is one of the items that I picked up and I really really enjoy it so we're gonna start out with this it is called a Palladio I'm glowing it's got a little bit of a, a pink tint to it and it's like really pearly looking really soft and it's not like straight silicone feeling it feels kind of moisturizing but really soft and nice you know what I'm the most proud of with he picked an eyebrow pencil this dude is not gonna let me go without my brows today I love that so all right primer is one and the foundation that he picked just happens to be one of my favorite drugstore this is the Flower Beauty Light Illusion Luminous Makeup Nude Skin Feel. It has a broad spectrum of SPF 18 sunscreen and my shade is Ivory L2. It might be just a smidge too light for me right now because I have gotten a little bit darker this summer but I can always warm it up with bronzer. So I'm just gonna dot that all over. So like Hayden told you, he is nine years old and I'll be honest with you, I was not that girl that like always wanted to be a mom, wanted to be married. I wasn't like planning my wedding at like seven years old. I just never was that girl. And my husband and I got married in 2006 and then we're surprised when we found out that Hayden was on the way in 2008 and I was so freaking terrified of being a mom I was like you know I don't really like kids that much like I'm not a huge kid person um will I, will I be a good mom like well how, how am I gonna do with this and this child he was born five weeks early um tiny little five pound ten ouncer and he m made it so easy to be a mom just like from the beginning, just the best baby, always happy, always smiling. He was, you know, I went back to work at 12 weeks, I think, 10 or 12 weeks, and he started sleeping through the night like a week or two before. So just like perfect, just the perfect kid. Um, he, of course, had his moments like every kid does, um, but he just all in all has been such a good kid and has made it so easy to be a mom. And then we decided to have another we spaced him about he was six years old when his little sister was born um, mainly because daycare was just so expensive and we were couldn't figure out how people make it and pay for two or three kids in daycare 
Um, but he is the best big brother. He loves his little sister so much. Um, and it, it's so sweet to watch them. I myself have a brother who is five years older than me. And he is one of my very best friends. So it's so nice to see the bond that they share. And I hope that they always have it. Of course, she's three and she's kind of a, she can be a turd. So um, she's mean to him sometimes, but he takes it in stride. He's a good big brother and he will always take care of her and I know it. So, okay, we finished with foundation and he picked for me the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer, which is also one of my favorites. It's like, it's like he watches me get ready every day or something. <laughs> but to be serious, like he's been forced to watch a few too many makeup videos. So I can't say I'm really all that surprised. This concealer is just so soft and blends out so nicely. And it covers pretty well too. I've got like a little blemish right there I'm trying to cover up. And it brightens underneath the eyes. As I've gotten older, I've gotten quite a few more fine lines in here and I don't feel like this settles into them too deep. So Hayden is going into the fourth grade. He is starting at a brand new school this year. Um, they just built a new school up the road and he is so excited. He's got, he is leaving some of his friends at his old school, which he's sad about, but some of his friends from other schools are going to be coming to the new school. So he'll have all new friends to hang out with all the time. And he's really looking forward to that, even though he is sad that he'll be missing some of his other friends. So, um, I'm excited for him. Um, and he, you know, he's such a smart little boy and, and just so sweet and kind hearted. And I know he'll make even more friends that he didn't have before. So I'm excited for him. Oh, and in case you're wondering, my cup says, I run on caffeine, chaos, and cuss words. And it fits me, it's true. And my nail polish today is Ruby Slippers. It's like red, it's really deep red, and it has this gorgeous sparkle in it that I don't think the camera is going to pick up very well. But it's by China Glaze, and it's almost the 4th of July, so I thought I would go with red. And I don't normally do red, but I like this color, and I thought it's 4th of July, so I'm going with it. So, okay, we have foundation and concealer on. I am going to go in and, with a little bit of powder and set underneath my eye, and for that he chose the CoverGirl Advanced Radiance Pressed Powder. Honestly, I kind of forgot that I had this. I haven't used it in so long, but I have hit pan on it a little bit. So I'm just going to really lightly press that in with my damp beauty sponge. I told him he didn't have to pick out the tools because that would be way too overwhelming. There's so many. I have like a ridiculous amount of brushes sitting in front of me. Here, I'll show you. This isn't even all of them. I have tons of them. So um, I didn't want to overwhelm him with all of that. So I picked the tools. He picked the makeup. And that's how we're going to roll with it. Ooh, I kind of forgot how much I like this powder. It's really kind of like blurring. I like that. And I, if I'm remembering correctly, this is, this shade is creamy natural, but if I'm re remembering correctly, this is for like drier skin type, so it shouldn't like look too cakey underneath my eyes, and I like that, so. All right, like I said, he picked out the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer for me. So I'm gonna go in and apply this. This is a crown brush, and I have worn the number right off of it. I'm sorry. I know I got this in a boxy charm, but um, this is a, a crown brush, I know for sure. Top, tap off the excess, and then I'll start warming up my skin. I'm wearing blue today, so he picked out the Sweet Peach palette. I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do for my... I shot. I'm kind of going through the colors in my head, like, what's going to look good with this? I feel like I share this bronzer in every single video, 
seriously, hands down, it is the best. Like, I have the Tarte Park Avenue Princess, and I pick this up before I pick it up every time. Um, of course, the Tarte is a little bit more deep toned, but I can wear that in the summer normally, and I'm still reaching for this one. Okay, bronzer. And I'm gonna go in with a Lexi 660 Precision Foundation Brush for my blush. This is one of the ones I recently got in my BoxyCharm. I have used it for blush and not foundation, but I'm doing what works for me. Living my best life. And he picked for me the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush. The shade is Blushing Bride. So I'm just gonna put that on the apples of my cheeks. Did he find, did he pick a highlighter for me? Did he pick a highlighter? He did pick a highlighter for me. It ain't my favorite, but it will work. This is the Maybelline Master Chrome by Face Studio, Face Studio Metallic Highlighter. The shade is Molten Rose Gold. I don't reach for this one too often just because it's just not as like a natural look that I would go for, but it's still a good highlighter in a drugstore. So it's under nine or eight or nine dollars, I think. So I'm going to go in with my Mikasa F120 tapered highlighting brush and I'm just going to dab that on the high parts of my cheek and above my brow bone. You can build this thing up to, uh, look at that, you can see that from the sky. The only thing I don't really like about this, like I can deal with an intense highlighter, the only thing I don't really like about it is, like I have a little bit of texture right here and it kind of accentuates that just a little bit, but if you have really great, like perfect skin, you'd probably really like this. So, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do my brows, but I'm gonna do those off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so I very quickly threw my brows on and for the, the brow pencil that he picked for me is the Anastasia Brow Wiz pencil. I am at the very end of my rope on this pencil, which makes me sad. I'm going to have to go out and get another one or something comparable to it because I really like it. So, the brows are done. I am going to start in on my eyeshadow. And he chose the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette. This was in one of my, this was my five most loved palettes. So, I'm trying to look at this and figure out what I want to do for what I am wearing today. This is the it Cosmetics Brushes for Ulta Airbrush Shadow Brush. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into this shade right here. This is Peaches and Cream. And I'm just going to lay that down all over my lid to give it a soft kind of white base. I'm going to go up to my brow bone with it. And I think I'm gonna do something neutral, but throw a pop of color on too. My hated man, he is a baseball player. So, so he plays like recreational baseball in the spring and then in the summer he plays on like a travel baseball team. It's not like a really far travel, but like, you know, an hour, hour and a half away. So, um, he is really having fun this year, um, but the team that he's on this year, all of the boys are, they get along so well, and he's having so much fun, and I'm really enjoying watching him, you know, play and enjoy his summer. So, I might throw a picture in here if I can, like right up here, of my little dude pitching. So, okay, so I got that first shade laid down, and the color was called Peaches and Cream. I am going to go in with the It Cosmetics Brushes for Ulta Airbrush Crease Brush. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the shade Georgia, this shade here, and I'm gonna run that into my crease. It's a bit of a pinky, like a light pink peachy color. And if I had to bet, I bet he picked this palette because it smells good. 
because he has looked through my palettes before and he's like, oh mom, this one smells really good. So I bet he picked it for that reason. And the scent aside, the shades and the formulation of these shadows are like perfect. I wear them several times a week. Alright, so I've got the crease shade in, and I think what I'm going to do next is lay down a kind of a lighter, hmm, what do I want to do? I am going to lay down a darker brown all over my lid, is what I'm going to do. And I am going to use this Mikasa E230 brush to do that, and I'm going to wet it. Oh, I can't wet it. He didn't give me any Fix Plus crap. All right, we're gonna make it work. Okay, so this shade I'm gonna use is Puree. Whoop. Puree right here. So I'm gonna lay that down all over my lid. It's a nice darker matte brown. This little hair that just won't get out of my way. There we go. All right, and then in the very outer corner, I am going to deepen it up a little bit, and I'm going to use this Mikasa E310 pencil brush. So I'm going to go into the shade Caramelized, and it is this shade right here. And I'm going to put that all into the outer corner and a tiny bit into my crease. It's not a whole lot darker, just slightly. I like that. It's got a tiny bit of shimmer to it. Now this palette retails for $49. I got mine from Ulta after Christmas with gift card, but if you go to Too Faced.com and you sign up for their emails, a lot of times they will send a coupon code. Like a lot of times, I think I get 20, I haven't bought anything from their actual website, um, but they have sent me a couple of times a 20% off plus free shipping coupon code. So you can get this, this palette for cheaper. I also really like their um, Too Faced Natural Eyes collection. I have the OG Natural Eyes. I don't have the matte version, and they have recently reformulated, so I don't have like the newest version of it, but um, I've seen lots of reviews on it that say it's just as good as the original. This is the E300, and I'm going to use it to blend everything out, kind of make it look a little more seamless. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in, uh, I'm not going to use a brush, I'm going to go in with my finger and I'm going to dip into the shade Luscious right here and I'm just going to pat that on the inner third of my eyelid. It's kind of like a champagne-y gold color and I, I live for these champagne colors. I don't know what it is like. I have a hard time doing just an all matte eyeshadow look. Like, it needs some sparkle. It needs some shimmer. I'm sorry. I'm a shimmery girl. I can't. I can't help it. I love the shimmer shadows. All right. He didn't pick an eyeliner. So. I'm going to go in and I'm going to line with one of these shadows with a, let me find my brush that I want to use. This is the Mikasa E100 brush. 
I'm going to dip into the shade Tempting. It is like a black sparkle. And I'm going to line my upper lid with that shade. Normally I would use some Fix Plus, but it wasn't part of the plan today. And there I go, getting it all over the outer corner of my eye. I'm a professional, y'all. Can you tell? Okay. I'm not... I am, I'm screwing this all up with just this black eyeliner. Okay, it isn't perfect. That's okay. It doesn't have to be. I'm going to use a baby wipe because I got black eyeshadow all over my hands and now it's going to be all over my face if I don't. So, okay. I'm going to throw a little bit of a pink shade on the bottom lash line. So I'm going to use this. This is a Vintage Cosmetics Company brush. This came as part of a, a set. This is the step three and it says, go girl, go. So this girl's going to go. So I'm going to use this shade here. This is Candied Peach. And I'm just going to take it on the brush and I'm just going to run it underneath my lower lash line. I'm going to pick a different brush. I don't like this one. All right, I'm gonna go with this one. This is a Malika Jeffreen KP10. It's a pencil brush. It's not a lot of color, but it's something. I said some Mac, Mac Fix Plus would be awesome, but I'm not breaking the rules. I am using what he picked for me. He was so nervous about being on here. He said, Mom, I'm nervous. Said, this is all you wanted. You wanted to be on YouTube. He watches YouTube all the time. And I don't understand. What is it with kids watching other kids play games on YouTube? Like, just go play the game. Like, why are we watching kids play the game on YouTube? I don't know. It's odd, but we didn't have YouTube when I was little, so maybe, maybe I would have too when I was younger, but times are so much different now. Okay, so got that finished, and we are going to go in with mascara. I'm going to grab my eyelash curler, and for mascara, he was awesome, and he picked the Tarte Tartist Lash Paint in Black. Okay, so I am finished with eyes, finished with face. The only thing I have left is lips. I'm gonna go ahead and take my hair down and wipe that mascara off my eyelid. All right, what did he pick for lips? Where is it at? He picked a NYX Butter Gloss. He knows his mama. So, ooh, we're going bright pink today, y'all.
All right, guys, I'm done. So this is it. This is everything my little man picked out for me to put on my face today. He did a pretty good job. I mean, there are some colors I wouldn't have picked, clearly, but you know, he's a nine-year-old boy and bless his little heart, he worked hard and picked some of the best things I could have asked him to pick. He didn't forget my better bronzer. He gets bonus points just for that. So hold on just one minute. I'm gonna go grab him. Okay, guys, he's back. So, okay, what's your favorite part of the makeup look? Tell them right there. Um, lipstick. You like the lipstick, the hot pink lips? Yeah. Hmm. What made you pick hot pink? I don't know. You don't know? You just went for it, right? Yeah. All right, how'd I do with my eyes? Do you want to look at them? How'd they, I do? Look, they look perfect. They look perfect. You're sweet. You're I sweet. I think that you look pretty. Aw, I love you, buddy. So this wraps it up. I think my little man did pretty good picking out some makeup. Um, poor guy, he's been subjected to so many makeup videos. Am I right, bud? Yeah. <laughs> it's all right, he's a trooper. So this wraps it up. I hope you have enjoyed this video. I hope you'll subscribe to my channel. Just click the little subscribe button down below. Hit the notification bell so that you will be notified anytime I do upload a new video. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.